Can you beat anything but a bullseye with that big blue vest on? Let's go. Geeks, what's poppin'? Marvel Legends. Daredevil the Man Without Fear, apparently. But this is really a three-pack, but nobody else is mentioned on the cover. All right, I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm gonna marry that Electra. Woo, she's smoking. Look at that white and that hair. That's dope. All right, so we got that Daredevil, and he is on the Renew Your Vows body, so yay. Now, Bullseye, don't know what body he's on, but I think we need an updated Bullseye. Haven't got one in a while. Accessories. All right, Daredevil comes with two sets of hands, gripping hands and fists. He comes with his batons and he comes with the steel cable that goes between them. All right, for Bullseye, we got the alternate screaming head. We got a knife with no deco. We got a gripping hand, a fist, a knife throwing hand, and a pointing figure hand. And for Electra, we've got her twin size, her fists, her katana, and the alternate head sculpt with the big hair. Digging this. <laughs> Here's Bullseye. Yo, check your Bullseye. Look at this. Mine shipped with the wrong hand. This is his left arm. It has a right hand on it. I thought maybe I just put the wrong one on, but nope. I shipped with two right hands. So now I gotta call Hasbro Pulse tomorrow. Yeah, the head sculpt is nice. This head sculpt's fire too. Does look a little bit big for his body though, but just on camera. In real life, it looks fine. Head sculpt looks good. I like the way the hair is waving there, blowing in the wind. Even close up, doesn't get that uncanny valley range. Still looks really good. Look at all this 90s hair. If you weren't around, You won't appreciate it. Yeah, this bullseye looks really good. Both head sculpts, but I'm especially digging this one. And if you notice both head sculpts, he's missing a tooth. So the tension of details there. The bullseye's forehead is carved in. Paint job is really good. I'm just not digging this blue. I would have preferred if they had kept it black. I never seen this rendition of his costume in the comic book, but I assume it exists. Now this looks like a gun holster, but it seems to fit this knife perfectly, so. I don't know. See, the blade even hangs out to the bottom. So this must be for his little knives if it open, and this is for the big dagger. People online have been saying it was for a gun, but I don't think so. I think it's for a knife. Now this effect is really cool. This is prop. I think this is the same one they used for uh, Death Dealer. I think they just changed the colors on it. But yeah, superb. Electra is tight work. 
I'm glad we got her, even though she lost the fan vote. Now her skirt does move around so you can put her extra side in there because she doesn't have a space for it. I originally put it in the front, somehow it worked its way to the back. But you want to be careful of the legs so it doesn't get bent up. Head sculpt's nice. Hair is nice. Paint job is nice. Her tights are painted on, not sculpted. Got the pinless legs and the pinless elbows. That's the kind of update that we are looking for. Now at first I thought Electra was a prize, but this Daredevil man, you can't beat it. This Renew Your Vows body is like the best Marvel Legend body ever. I mean, it just works. The only thing I wish, another head sculpt. Something besides this stoic look. And the DD on his chest, I wish it had been carved in. Maybe it would stand out a little bit more. But other than that, man, just like the Spidey, this is perfection. There's not one pose you can't get out of this guy. Now, one drawback to the batons having these cables shooting out of them, they don't have the peg where you can join them together. So you can't click them together like he does in the comic book. But I guess that's okay. But man, he is whew, pure fire. If you don't want the whole three pack, I'd say he's definitely worth paying for in the aftermarket. Tight work. All right, there you go. Hasbro Pulse exclusive Daredevil Electra Bullseye three pack. Is it worth it? In my opinion, yes. Bullseye, the only complaint I have is that blue in his torso. Electra, no complaints whatsoever. Daredevil, I wouldn't call it a complaint. I just wish that DD was carved in. But man, this box set, worth it. Hasbro's dropped a lot of Marvel Legends box sets in the past month. I think this is what, the fourth or fifth one? And they are taxing us, but this one, if you gotta get any of them, I'd say get this one, almost flawless. But that's my humble opinion. Let me know what you think. Make sure to sound off in the comments. Let's talk about it. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, turn notifications. Thanks for tuning in for another unboxing and action figure overview. Till next time, geek out.